We've got unfinished business. Where's that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid kid. If you just hadn't dropped that fucking thing, I could let you go. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way out of here. Okay. Uh, so first of all, we look at this fucking thing. That's our best friend in the game. We turn it over. We pull out its innards. Like so. And then, because what we need to do is we need to get through here, and there is literally no way that, you know, like, pure strength will be able to deal with that duct tape. It's not even, like, heavily plastered on it. You just get your fingers under there and just pull. Anyway. You slap it on here. And then this puzzle has killed speedruns for me. Absolutely killed them. So that looks right. And that looks right. They might not be right, but... And... The, no, I don't, the, the square there doesn't fit, so we need one that's also a triangle star on one side. Oh, there. Uh, not you? Oh, you. Square triangle there, and oh my god, I need a square circle. When is the killing end? That works. This is this is the one sticking point. You have a train star. So do you have? Ah, oh, there we go. Then we get a pair of uh, places, you know, just scissors for playing with. Put this. Glide it through. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Uh, uh, I had a hiccup. Is this? this is where he watches you sleep. And we just push it over and we're welcomed by that. That majestic beast. Hello. <laughs> Don't run. Look at that toil. I can make toil soup out of that. And slip. Keep that noise down, young lady. So now, I'm not too sure what happens here. Maybe we can figure it out on the way back, but... Over here, and climb under these building block houses. Nice, look at that shoddy design right there. That's not, that's not held on tight at all. That must be the door out of here. Yeah, let's go, baby. Go, go, go. I need a key. Darn it! That alligator's from Resident Evil 7. I like him more here, though. He's a fun guy. Tom's diary. It's been two months since I sent that letter to Oliver, and I've got all back as nada. Zip. Then again, they're all out there once they get adopted. Bet he's living like a king in some fancy folks home, forgotten all about us. Really thought Oliver was different. They'd be my friend for life. Guess I'm just a fool. And sat all the little kids down and told them a story. She said all the kids get adopted and turn into food for the boogeymen. That's why no one hears from them again. 
Not sure where she gets her ideas from, but she's got a mind for Russian trashy, writing trashy horror novels. Also, that'd be pretty horrifying. It's like, and if you get adopted, it's a death sentence. There's something weird going on around here, and not just because of her stories. Don't get me wrong, I've been in worse places. This place is funded by some big drug company, but why can't people, why can't we call people to go outside? Why are there so many doctors around? What's with these shots every day? It's almost like we're... I'm getting adopted. Me. Most people go for young ones. So I figured I was too old, but I can't say I'm not a little happy. Who am I kidding? I'm psyched as fuck. I say goodbye to this place on 20th. I'm going to try my best to be a good son. Someone my mom and pop could be proud of. Oliver came back at me looking there, all messed up and screaming out me and stuff. I didn't even recognise him at first. His face was all peeling and melted off. He's with the teachers and doctors now. It's just a skin thing, they say. You'll get better soon. And then we can go on adventures together again. Lit. Hype. Poggers. Am I right, gamers? You know I'm right. Oh no, it's him. What are you doing exactly, sir? Hey. Um, it's the first time I've actually... I've, I've never noticed that window was slightly open before. Blank's diary. If you read in this, go call police. Boogeyman's here. Eating everybody. Bobby, sorry. Many bark... Woogie man's here. Help. They're coming. Help me, mommy. That's just horrifying. You're a 22 year old pig. You white all over and his forever. Since you're dead, I'll let you off for having your toes on show. Now, don't mind me. Just uh, gonna lean over and get this key real quick. Look at that Fitbit. Where you going, Sherry? I told you to stay put. Itch me a quick. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Just please. Time to teach some manners. Uh. Ah! Oh! You little bitch. You're gonna pay for this! Oh, you little shit! You should probably wash that off, bro. You hear? Hey! You are gonna be so fucking sorry! Go away! I mean, after you melt a guy's no, half face, somebody, please. he's probably not gonna give up easy. Stupid bitch, that's a dead end. Leave me alone. And here, here's a snug little spot. Hey, bro. All right, I'm gonna remember the, remember the other uh, path. Does he go around here? Where are you? Show yourself! Yeah. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. I'm going weirdly quick on some, some sideways strafes. Then he pushes that out of the way because for some reason something fell and was blocking me. Oh god. Oh god. And then he flashes his torch down there. Somewhere. And then I squat walk down here. God damn it. And then you go right under this table. The table you can't go as deep under as you'd like to. And if you're lucky. He'll scoot you with his foot and drag you along. That's the best time. Alright, come on. 
He voice acts a character in Resident Evil 7 as well, who also makes a lot of moaning, whinging, hurt noises. <sighs> Heavy breathing and son of a bitch. You know, all that shit. This is your last fucking chance. Show yourself. Now! It's your last chance, mate. Go wash that off. There, I mean, that's what I'm talking about. It burns! Got slid like I was hitting a rev gym. Come on. Got it. Now you should lock him in, but the game doesn't let you. So see you. Where the fuck is my key? Oh, I hit the light now. See you. Hurry, hurry, hurry. And get out. Oh, it's chained. Nice try, Sherry. That is fast as fuck. I feel like I would uh, be dead in this situation. I don't think I could use keys that fast. I'm coming in, Sherry. No, you can't. Here's Johnny me. Get over here, you little bitch. Hide and seek champion Sherry. The game is over. No! Now you're in trouble. Let me go. Oh. Mouth penetration couldn't have happened to a worse person. I mean it. 30 minutes earlier? Good to see you again, Claire. <laughs> Man, that didn't seem fair. Come on. What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time. Bring me the pendant or Sherry dies. The pendant? What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Is Sherry all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Are you serious? Damn it. Lock that in there. Just you wait, asshole. Yeah, asshole. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come out of there and I'm gonna shove a tentacle right in your mouth, and you're gonna be so fucking sorry. Uh, got everything I need as far as I'm aware. Yeah, that should be enough. Maybe. It'd be fine. I'll handle it. <laughs> oh, I'm wet. Oh. Slide up here, and I just slot this in, and away we go. You again? Huh? Oh god, he's mad. You do a loop the loop and pull, and your shoes are looking cool. I took your earth, mate. I can beat him on an incline. He's got stumpy legs, he can't go uphill very fast.
and you push that gate over. And then we loop a little bit more. Because I need these guys to get away from that gate. Oh shit. Go on, you be cheeky with me, young fella Mullard. Slip. Oh, it's easy. Looks like the only way forward. And then he's like, that's a safe zone. I'll let you off. For now. And this area is actually a, a homage to a. Look at that umbrella poster. To the um, start of Resident Evil 2 originally, you went over this thing and went down some steps, and a woman looks like that. Oh, no. I mean, she ain't harming no one. So, uh, hop over this real quick. That dog, however, is well and truly harming someone. Easy like Sunday morning. Ah. That should be the real sound. <laughs> you fell over. Oh, my belly is a rumbling. We're at four o'clock and I've only had a bowl of cereal. And I've also been recording for two and a half hours. I don't like giving these dogs a chance to do anything nasty. Because if you're on caution, they can pretty much kill you. Um, not that they have like a one-shot move or anything like that, but they... Um, They can cut past you like that. And then often uh, jump back on you a second time from that point. There was no one to bang on the duel. Also, they did nearly unhooking that. My pistol is out of armor. Which means it actually served its purpose, because I've just switched to the other handgun. And I run faster because I'm in caution. Nice! Is that the only chain there? I guess it could have been doable. Oh, I have the pendant. Hello? I have the pendant! This is quick tool for help us later. Sherry, are you here? Now, why did that table just collapse under the weight of some boxes? Why hadn't it collapsed earlier? I think this fade real quick. Regarding the incident in question, I'm glad to report it's all been taken care of. On February 19th, subjects 628 escaped from the lab and broke into our facility. 628 was originally from this facility's Canterville pool and apparently returned in the hope of seeking help. It was quickly detained. As 6 to 8 was undergoing one of the lab's clinical trials, there was a distinct possibility that he had brought the virus with him, so we disposed of all the test subject candidates as a precaution. Their speedy disposal was conducted by the security team, to whom I'd like to extend my thanks. As for our neighbours, we told them it was used to the building's dilapidated state. We'd moved all the children to a different orphanage for their safety. As to the future of this facility, once it's been fully decontaminated, I plan to resume securing more test candidates. So they were like, listen, one of our um, kids who were turning into a zombie um, got back here, so we had to kill all the zombies, all, all, all the children, just in case. Also, this is horrible. I would not like to be in that shower. 
getting changed for, for, for PE or gym, depending on where you're from, was bad enough in a communal locker room. People's obsession with seeing your penis. What's up with them? What's up with kids, there? Eh? Why do I want to see people's penises so much? Ah! Your fault! What? It took too long! What happened? Oh, God. Get, get off me! Looks like he pissed himself too. I know that's blood, but I don't know with that kind of hemorrhage, and who knows what you'd piss. To be frank, you. Hey, what's going on? And there was a chance you may have still been alive, and then that fell on you. I'm hoiting. I'll, I'll I'll take this double herb because I'll get me into the good fine. Also, apparently he was pinning down a bat. Is that a bat? I assume so. This is, oh. Where are you? This is where you just keep absolutely hundreds of just random supplies. Claire! Sherry! Oh. I'll be right there! Oh! Oh! See you! Go, go, go! Survival of the fist! Claire! It's behind you! Don't stop! Probably to knock on my door. That's cannon. I got the first. Second head activate. Goodbye. She grew up. Hold still. Not infected. What the? Sherry. Where's Sherry? Sherry. Sherry's fine. Do you know Sherry? It's an impressive display of strength. What happened to her? We have to assess the situation. Who are you? I'm Claire. I didn't foresee this. Excuse me. Where is she? Hello? What? Where oh, she? Annette. Tell me, what happened to William? I don't know. Who's, who is that? The creature responsible for this. Can you help me find Sherry? Seems to be evolving much faster than expected. Where are you going? Look, I don't have time to play 20 questions. Everything's under control. I need to find Sherry. My daughter is not your concern. She has like wrapped a ponytail in her own hair. I don't think that works. I mean, I'm not a, I'm not a, a hair -a magician or anything. But I don't think your hair can like tie a knot into your own hair. Where did Sherry go? Sherry's daughter? She's not my daughter? 
Get out of town. High powered rounds, you say? Report about G. The G virus clinical trials will be entering its final phase soon. Before G, the new creature that will surpass humans, is born, allow me to predict a few things about its biology and biological functions. This is just what they're kind of hoping will happen. They're hoping that the subject's intelligence will drop immediately with their linguistic abilities disappearing for a matter of days, and then they'll lose their capacity for reason and humanity. The natural evolution of humanity. Uh, G will be a creature of pure instincts, driven only by a need to survive and fuck. Due to its unusually accelerated cell division, evolution, it will be highly adaptable to any environment. Furthermore, of its amazing ability to repair itself through regeneration, it will be extremely difficult to completely kill it with any conventional small firepower. Reproductive behavior. G's most remarkable feature will be its intense desire to fuck. It will in instinctively search out humans with DNA that closely matches its own and implants a baby in them. But the chances of success are very low, and if the DNA is not close enough to produce a match, an underdeveloped G creature will pop out of their chest. Um, I suppose the only ones who might be close enough for a match might be any biological children of the subject. Boom. So it's like it's trying to, it, it wants to hunt. So you said like it was daddy, that thing's a dad. It's gonna try and it's gonna try and fuck little girl Sherry. And we need to stop it. We need to be like, oi, that's not okay. None of that is okay. Not in my backyard, thank you very much. I got this gun powered. I am not hurting for ammo, realistically. Uh Take a red. I'll take a I'll take a green and a red as well. Just make sure I'm uh, I'm topped up and ready to roll. You, you quit going down, young fellow monk, and put you away. Okay. Back with my old trusty handgun. Now that's funny. Alright, okay. Load in the sewers. Come on. Get out of your system. Oogie. This sewers really needs to cleaned up. Sewer water should be drinkable. Every everyone knows this. Cable car here. Umbrella. Are you? Why have I no? Thank you, Kate, Kate, Kate. You know what? Oh. I believed. I chose to believe. You asshole. Bastard. I'm 
I'll let you pick up my flame shells. Look at that guy. Now he is a respectable gentleman. Copy of emails to Umbrella HQ. Director Owen, there are alarms going off all over nets. I don't know what's going on, but I can hear gunfire and I can't reach my section chief. Wear traps, please, and then help ASAP. Director Owen, the situation here is dire. NAS has been contaminated with a virus. It's unbelievable. The failsafe system didn't activate at all. Is this to work of outsiders? I can't imagine who else it could be. But why? Mayor and Kim are dead. I can't stop coughing. Why won't you answer me? Director Owen, it was you. It was you all the... But then he hit send. Um... S-Z-F? What a fucking gamer. This is why they teach courses in university on how to be convoy. Damn it, she right passed there. out from parental neglect. <laughs> Terrible thing to see happen right before your eyes. Um, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'll put you away just in case I end up picking up more ammo. I'm locking the U area door. I lost a thing that tells you how to unlock the door. During that last mad dash of a transfer. I know you have to stick one plug into each terminal, but if anyone remembers which plug goes where, please be a pal and share by posting the info on this board. Ugh. What a complicated lock. The Rook and Knight are on the same wall, and the Bishop and the Queen are not next to each other. The Queen and Rook were opposite to each other too. And the Pawn's in there. And the Rook should be there. Do we have yeah, the rook's in here. What a silly, silly Billy. There you are. Oh, that's, that's a knight, sorry. Sorry, everybody. I know I know what the rook is. The rook is the castle. Anyway. I'm pretty sure... This one. Goes over here. We'll find out when the time comes. You'll be fine, Claire. Don't you worry. See that guy there? Yeah, asshole. Where's all your frames at? Red up, don't mind if I do. A T bar. Um everyone's favourite WWE wrestler. Uh, you got one heat resistance safe, and we've written the combination on the side in chalk. <laughs> and a blue herb. I'll add that to the red. My herb collection is doing so good. Two twelve eight.
reinforced frame and attach that to that. Oh, look at that. That, that, that's, that's power in your pocket. And now it, um, now it can hold powerful ammo. I don't know what a powerful ammo is unless it's just, oh, it's there now. I, I made it spawn. So now it's a pistol and a magnum, but I have to swap out each time. Oh god. I can do this. Excuse me. Piece of shit. I knew it, you cheating bastard. How's my knife looking? Scuffed. Did anyone say you could get up? So it wasn't me. Let me go over here and use my uh, my T bar. Get this key. Now this is a nice looking place. I remember when I first came down here, it actually made me think of hell. Like just seeing that, I was like, this is hell. If I was a religious person, this this is where I would I would be uh, threatened with ending up if I sinned. Get all that sewage water in my grenade launcher. I'm going up. I want the world to know. Ooh. Excuse me. That's a secret enemy we'll deal with later. Feeling uh, particularly in the mood for dealing with him now. Maybe I'll pop him a few times in the face. Like so. Oh, he is really screaming. So that's what the new gun's all about. I am pouch. And a roll of film. Hiding place. That's what it said in it. Seriously? Back up for a second. Oh no.
Imagine if he turns to crimson heads. Boy, that would suck. Listen. Will you just calm down? <laughs> Got airtime on that shot. If I hear some whinging coming from this room. That's what I thought. It's called a red field. Remember the fucking name. That's the second time I've said that. I hope it was just as funny as the first time. Slot. Big shit. Yes, I agree. Are you dead, dead? Oh, yeah, his head blew up, didn't it? Hey there. I'll take that cassette tape. Now, I don't know how far I can go down here before people start attacking me, and I really can't be asked dealing with them, so. Oh! Yeah. You are off the limits, my friend. Stay in the sewers where you belong, you stinky boy. We gave him the right to be so stinky, yeah? And get rid of you. Um, you know what? Let's make some handgun ammo. I've been some submachine gun ammo. Look at it. Wait, wait. Uh, this is uh, where you get the uh, SZ uh, code from. Something about this just made me really want to push up. Okay, I was just checking messages. There we are. So, you may you may recognize this place from earlier. This is going into the parking lot. But there's a few particular reasons. One, we need to get our badge back so we can open that. But we also need to go and develop that roll of film for the hiding place. This is uh, where some special secrets. I'll cut to the points. This is going to take a, a hot minute, comparatively. Also, we can get back out through here because we got this T-bar. And now I'm pretty sure we don't need that ever again. There's one more thing we could use it on, but we're not going to use it on. Um, put you away as well. I don't see a need for that, but I'll take it. I'll give you a oh quick God, death. No. I'm sorry. So, through here. Felt this. There's a desk and another desk with a microphone and a stereo. Oh, 
talk, see if there's anything in there. I don't know. Um, so. Okay, so. Get our dongle back. Because that thing that I showed us needing to open, you need a badge to open it. And if we slide this back down, it'll slot in. And this is one of the hiding places, so we can open this. For some reason, we needed his permission to do it. A wooden box. And there's also a roll of film back there, which is a bit of a hint for the next bit. High capacity mag for my submachine gun. And I think that refills it, so I'll, I'll save it for now. But um, in the original Resident Evil 2, if you clicked on the Wesker's desk, 50 times, uh, you got treated to a secret photo. And first, uh, you don't need to click multiple times, apparently. That was my first click. I seem to remember it needing multiple clicks. Maybe they made it easier. I'm going to chew on a herb, just so you people don't have to listen to her grunting and groaning constantly. Oh uh, yeah, might improve the viewing experience for you. So let's uh let's see this uh rising rookie. And there you go. If in the original, if you search Wesker's desk fifty times, he had a weird picture of uh of of, of Rebecca Chambers from Resident Evil One and Zero, um just in some some short athletic gear. Really not. I don't. I don't. I don't think the legs like attach there. I think the hips are there. And then it goes down and the legs start there. That is really a... Uh, they slap together. But, uh... You know, this wouldn't be a full playthrough of Resident Evil 2 without showing you it. I mean, realistically, it's not a full playthrough of Resident Evil 2 because I'm not going to do a B-side for now. Uh, I'm just going to move on to Resident Evil 3. And the B side is where you play as uh, the other character, depending on who you started as. Um, and they're like at the outside on the other side of that gate, having to run away when the helicopter crashes in. You know, that area. Oh shit, I just remembered this place. Hey there, it's me. ammo real quick. Hey Cheeky, you were looking at me earlier, weren't you? And now to test it. Oh, it gave me the extra bullets that it would give me as ammo. Okay. Jesus. I like the way he crumbles. And this. This is the last hiding place. Neat seven needle cartridges. For all your acupuncture needs. And to finish this off. In this special case down here is a silencer for an SMG which is stored in a storage room which you also need this badge for upstairs. Now that is a lot of effort to, to uh, not let someone have a silencer for a submachine gun. But as you take two slots now, but um, to examine. It uh, reduces recoil and muzzle rise as well as, I believe, 
making it so as long as you don't hit the liquor in question, the liquor cannot hear you shoot. And now that, that's a worthy weapon. I don't remember having to stop. I'll take it. Stinky boy, you get back down. Take this rook. See, I know my pieces. Don't want to get me. And he should be just down that hole. Just hanging out. There he is. Just doing his thing. Making sure. I don't even care if you wake up. Yeah, should be enough to go through here. I only have one thing. Um, I'm, you're going to see me take some damage, I think. And that's okay. No, thank you. Jesus, they're everywhere. Now, I don't know a strat for dealing with these people. I'm gonna take some damage and it's okay. These are the enemies that poison you in the game. So I'm just gonna put that my red, green, blue. Kill the poison. And you see how it gives me that shield in the, the bottom left? That makes me immune to poison and, and also risks damage. But you know, I'm, I just snuck on through. It's okay. We're all we're all okay. Stop panicking. Sounds like they're singing at me. Oh, this way. <laughs> oh, I'm right out of ammo. Put the red and the green. Put the red and the green and put, and your shoes are looking cool. Oh, he did a did a finagle. You bastard! You bastard! <laughs> so if this being open, which means it's got the queen in it. Double checking. Ah, there's the blue. See, we're all back to where we started. Put the queen in here. This guy probably wants to uh, get me, so I'm gonna put. I'm gonna widen his asshole real quick. See. He got so much pleasure from that asshole widening, but he, his legs were too shaky to keep standing after that last bullet. Uh, true fact. Uh, so I need to grab... So go up here, first of all. Grab this king piece. Then that shuts. Yump off here. God, her hair fucking... I mean, think of a hunter. Jesus. Is this a king door? Yeah. 
And the spark shot. Weapon or weapon free technically. I kinda of want that to be different. Um Uh, one, you should be four. I'll, I'll take that. that. That's a settlement for me. And then we can unlock this. So this is weird. You, like, you fire it once and then you've got to hold it up. And it forces electricity at, at your enemies. And then take these back. And then... You put the queen back in here. And then we put the king in here. And then we go and take the queen back out. <coughs> then we go around. We get the king back. And winner, winner. What's, what's for dinner, papa? Chicken. That's what's for dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. You know the, you know the answer. Stop being ignorant. Hey. Kind of hard. He's leaving. Go, baby. Go, go, go. So I guess I may have wasted a shot. But it's okay. Because I say it's okay. And then... This guy gets up. Like he's gonna grab my giblets. But I don't let him. I hop down. And run around. Listen, if I have an option, I do not fight assholes. Okay, now for the fun part. What's that? Every part that we just did was fun? Well, thank you for uh, that vote of confidence. Um, but it's, it's, it's going to be a good one, let me tell you. Now, if I remember correctly. Uh, rook. King, Queen. God gamer. I've got I've got the god genes. Right, On my way. I'm the proto human. Um I might use that. That's gunpowder. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Um, so, we got this. That's a good one to have. I'll take a fade. I'm just going to take and sort this. I'll take some flash grenades. Put you away. And I'm going to take a green red. Better safe than sorry. And a whole heap of submachine gun ammo. And it's this USS uh, a digital video cassette. Shink. Why is he got why is his toe gonna be coming out of his shoe? That's my question. 
Let's just break this over my knee. Glad I watched that. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm with you, sister. That was a wholly needed thing. <laughs> 